Good morning, guys. So today's business networking tip is called, Are You Using Me? The answer to this question, of course, is, is yes. So this comes up a lot with my friends, and we never know how to really deal with it. I was talking to one of my marketing friends, and she's like, you wouldn't believe how many people call me. Hey, I got a quick question. Can you tell me about this? And that quick question um, ends up being, hey, can you develop my marketing plan for me? You know, so basically you're looking for free services without having to pay. Guys, you got to be cautious of this. You know, it's one thing like, hey, I got a quick question, you know, um, see a mortgage friend on right now. Like, hey, you know, how, where are rates? Something like that. Yeah, general information is fine. If you're trying to get a marketing plan from somebody for free, stop doing that. I signed a financial planner friend. He's like, yeah, people all the time basically want me to develop their financial plan. Don't want to be a client. Guys, this happens to me all the time, happened to me the other day, and you know, a friend asked what I do about it, and I'm like, you know what, I just kind of laugh, that's all you can do. I have this one guy, calls me for everything, you know, he's got questions about his business, and he's very active in two other networking groups, doesn't do anything with me. So finally, I'm like, hey man, did you ever notice that you call me every time you have a problem, but I've never seen you at an event? He's like, oh, yeah, 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 man, I've been meaning to come, and I just started cracking up. I'm like, dude, I've known you for three years. You've never come to an event, so why are you doing that? Why are you telling me you're going to come to an event because we both know you're not? You're a good dude, so I help you because I like you, but you're being unfair. You know, you're putting your time and money into other networking groups, but anytime you have a problem, you want to talk to me about it. Why don't you call them? Well, um, um, I, I don't know, dude. I just think you could answer my questions. Be cautious of this, guys. You know, don't use people. And it's super common. Like, most of the people who watch this video now will tell me there's at least one person that does it to them. You know, it's again, it's one thing like, hey, you know, just asking a quick question. But it's another thing, you know, when you're reaching out, it's tax season, reaching out to your, your friend who's a CPA, you know, that have them explain the tax laws to you. You're probably being a little unfair. Give some thoughts to this. Be very cautious about using people. Make sure that your relationships are two-way streets. You know, that you're doing something to help them. Or you know what, even once, just once, call them and say you're thankful for the help rather than asking a question. But be cautious of this because this something comes up a lot and you know, people get offended by it. You know, I'm trying to make a living but you want free advice. You know, if I called you and wanted you to work for me for free, how would you feel about it? I think that's the perfect way to end the video. All right, guys, thanks for watching. If you've got questions about networking, send me a message. You want to come to events, friendsofkevin.com, newenglandb2bnetworking.com. Thanks for watching. Hope you have a truly dazzling day.